So quick video question, Harley, can you please share your comments and criticisms of the David Wolf 2013 speaking tour? No, I've got nothing personal against David Wolf. Yes, he's tried to sue me on a few occasions. Nothing personal. I don't hate Dave Wolf. I do have a critique his nutritional and lifestyle advice. I personally believe drugs ain't healthy, high fat diets make you fat and bloated and unfit, and that fruit is actually health food. Yes, I promote fruit as healthy. What uh, grots me about David Wolf and his little Australian tour is uh, is the sink. It's all about the money, man. With Dave, it's all about the moolah. And hey, if you're a multimillionaire like Dave is, then I guess that's how you become a multimillionaire. Same with Matt Monarch. It's all about the money, man. <laughs> like they just spam you with fucking shit to buy continuously. I know because one of my email addresses, I subscribe to their little infomercial marketing. It says, boom, 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 buy this, buy that. Don't eat fruit. Don't do that. Buy this, buy that. You know, raw food's about packaged plastic products that came from Ecuador, Peru, China, Bolivia, etc. Countries of low income. We buy that product super dirt cheap, Indonesia as well, super dirt cheap, and we sell it to you super inflated prices. The only thing super about those superfoods is the profit margins. Anyway, so this uh, David Wolf talk is just, I'm clicking on here, I'll put a link down below. This is my comments and criticisms, nothing personal. Talks about you know, how spiritual everything is, and it's just got this like full on legal uh, conditions, you know, all this like, you know, sponsorship. So you can. What you have to do is, if you want to bring your product to a David Wolf talk, you have to pay them some good money. Now, if you come to my talk, and you're a local organic fruit farmer, and you want to share your stuff, you want to sell your stuff, I'm not going to ask you for a cent. In fact, I'll probably pay you to come to my talk to promote your product of fruits and vegetables. But Dave, he's the opposite. He wants to get them as much coin as he can, just like those spiritual people do. <laughs> It's hilarious. So you all these conditions and stuff. Here's what I found interesting was that where was it? You can't eat food at the talk. Here we go. Please note that the Brisbane and Melbourne event venues do not allow food to be sold and consumed on site. Packaged superfood powders. Packaged superfood powders. But don't eat fresh fruit and vegetables. Eat packaged superfood powders because that's where the money is. Anyways, whole foods are available to be sold, but no prepackaged snacks or food items that can be consumed. So basically, if you're hungry in the talk, the only food that you can eat there is stuff you've bought from that venue. Now, how spiritual and raw food is that, eh? That if you want to eat, if your children are hungry, smack them on the hand for eating that organic banana and walk outside and buy something, some little expensive, fat, greasy, cacao wowy superfood product that's going to give you a gut ache and a hangover the next day and give that to your kid instead. Because if you bring your fresh fruit in as Dave Wolf's talk, you might get kicked out. <laughs> Even though you paid good money to listen to a three hour, four hour infomercial where all you have to do is just turn around to the back wall and look how many products are for sale. And then you will find out what that person's intention is. It's money. Money, 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 money. Nothing wrong with making a bit of coin. I'm just saying some people are in it for the money and some people are in it for the good. That's my comments and criticisms. You asked for them. You got it. Carve the fuck up. And Dave, eat some fucking fruit. Lose that weight, buddy. Oh yeah, and Dave, you still owe Clinton about 300 bucks for an unpaid bill at his organic shop. Just for it to let you know.